Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're at the range with the Grand Power Scrawl Bog with the SBA3 brace on it, the A3 Tacticals lower receiver that take the Evo Scorpion mags and I got a Hollow Sun HS510C. Now we're at the range. Let's check for performance and see how it works. The mag went in like it should. It, it, it fed around. Let's see if it fires. If you see, the, the 10 round mags for the CZ Scorpion did not drop free. I have another one. Boat release work. One thing I can say, guys, right off the bat with this gun, with that with that trigger in it, it makes the straw box so much better. With the brace, it makes it easier to a lot more controllable with rapid fire. As you will see coming up right now, I try to dump the mags as fast as I can, and let's see if I hit the target. I mean, ten rounds pretty fast I hiccup a couple times but I mean it seemed to be working as it's supposed to with that brace I'm telling you, this effing tactical trigger in this gun is great I mean like I show you the uh the take up the that's the like that's the break guys barely touch it Reset is non-movable. It ain't it hardly moves at all. Then break again. The break is audible and the reset is audible and tactile. You can hear it and feel it. <clears throat> Let's uh do a couple more shots. Like doing double taps with the gun, guys, is like very, very easy. Like it takes hardly no effort whatsoever to double tap your gun and keep it on target. But guys, I'm telling you, the scrub bog with this brace on it and the regular, like your regular trigger out of your AR-15, I'm telling you, it makes this gun so much more enjoyable to shoot, easy to get on target, easy to control. Yeah. Okay, Q. Uh, what do you think about the scrub bog build? I, I definitely like this grip. Very, very comfortable. Get a very good hold of the gun. The trigger is very nice. The bolt reset is also very nice. The mag release, I'm not like, I like that, but I'm not too fond of it. Like that. Overall, very good uh, gun. Like the sight too, the Holosun. All right, if you were gonna change anything on the gun, what do you think you would change? Ooh. Hmm. I think the only thing that needs really be changed here is maybe the mag release I don't like I mean it's nice and all but I don't like that too much that's about it hey guys 
I can definitely say that this A3 Tactical Lure on the Scrawbog here is a big improvement over stock. The SVA Tactical Brace, it'll fold, keep it still, like very compact. The, the Hollow Sun works as it's supposed to. You know, only complaint I can have with the 10 round mags, the 10 round mags will not drop free. And that is the factory CZ mags. The Fostech grip, I mean, lets you get a good purchase on the gun. The Elfman tactical trigger, you know, it's very crisp, robust, very tactile. The, the boat release works as supposed to. I mean, if any of y'all guys have got a scrub bog and you definitely want to upgrade, and uh explore your options you know the the big benefits of this lower receiver guys is that you can use all ar controls you know like your your safety your grip and your trigger is all standard ar-15 parts you know you and the cz mags is a big upgrade over the Scrawbog mags, which I have not tried the curved mags yet, guys, but I definitely will. And I'll put the standard lower receiver back on and see how them how them mags perform. But if you like what you're seeing here today, make sure you follow me on Instagram, like my videos, share them. You know, I'm trying to get on up to a thousand subscribers, guys. You know what to do. Until next time, guys. I'll catch you on the next one.